The HubSpot integration syncs your Goldcast event users to your HubSpot contacts. This will allow you to create and update HubSpot contacts and track user activities. The following prerequisites must be satisfied before you can begin the HubSpot integration process. You will need event organizer access to your instance of Goldcast and a HubSpot account with permission to install apps in order to authorize the platform integration. Connecting a Goldcast org to HubSpot. Before beginning the HubSpot integration process, we recommend logging into your HubSpot account to avoid having to do so later in the setup process. To begin, select integrations from the admin panel. You will be redirected to the integration tools page. Select the HubSpot tile to continue. Once you have arrived at the authentication page, select connect. You will be redirected to the HubSpot OAuth page where you will be asked to choose an account to connect to your Goldcast org. Once you have selected an account, click the Choose Account button. Once the integration has been completed, information about the connected user, time of connection, and the connection status will display. If the current status of the integration is good, your HubSpot integration is complete. Enabling HubSpot settings for a Goldcast event. After creating an event in Goldcast, you may wish to connect it to your HubSpot account. This will allow you to sync your Goldcast event users to your HubSpot contacts list. Once a Goldcast event has been linked to a HubSpot account, you will be able to send emails to your event guests through the platform. Events created after a HubSpot account has been connected to your Goldcast org will have these settings turned on automatically. However, you will need to manually configure these settings for any existing events created before the account was connected. To begin, select the edit icon on the events page that corresponds to the event that you would like to link to your HubSpot account. You will be redirected to the events details page. Select the connected apps link from the event panel, followed by the open button on the HubSpot tile. The HubSpot integration is disabled by default. Select the Disable for Event toggle to enable it, then select the Save Changes button. A green success message will appear to indicate that your settings have been updated. After you have enabled HubSpot settings for your event, you will need to configure your timeline activity settings. These settings will determine what information about event users is included in their HubSpot contact profiles. Timeline activities track user engagement and interaction with your event, such as attendance, time spent at the event and participation in polls, Q&A sessions, and discussion groups. Before beginning this process, verify that the HubSpot integration has been enabled for your event and its current status is good. Select the Timeline Activities tab at the top of the HubSpot Connected Apps page. Once you have been redirected, use the toggles to enable or disable timeline activities as needed. When you are finished, click the Save Changes button. A green success message will appear to indicate that your timeline activity settings have been updated. Event users and HubSpot contact profiles. After you've connected your HubSpot account to an event in Goldcast, all event users registered for the event will automatically have a contact profile created for them in HubSpot. Once an event user has been registered, they will begin having timeline activities associated with their contact profile. Registrations in Goldcast can take up to five minutes to import into your HubSpot contacts. If you do not see your new registrants in your contacts list, check back in a few minutes.